All right, guys, here's the setup for this one at uh, San Joaquin for White Sturgeon. Basically, money farm, farming for money. You can see I've got a cat boxer here, and I've got two bottom snipers. My three bottom rods are the only ones I use out here. Uh, you definitely want to have spawn sack on here. I know other baits will work, but spawn, spawn sack it works better than any other bait I've tried. You definitely want your strongest rods, reels, lines, and, and leaders on here. Absolutely. These things have snapped um, my best leaders before. They've snapped my best lines, and I've lost some sinkers out here. I've lost some leaders. I've lost some... Uh, I've had to redo several poles here. Several setups, I mean. Uh, you'll see here the marker that I do put down for... It doesn't really matter. Uh, this this whole area, this whole 15, 20 foot circle area is, that I'm going to be fishing in, you can catch them anywhere in there, but your smartest bet, I don't know if this is a graphical error in the game or something that they didn't intend to be in the game. Uh, when I get out here and actually throw these lines out, I reel everything back into the 15, 16 foot mark. I think you can go as far as 18 or 19. But you can actually come in to within one click before your rod actually pulls your uh, line out of the water. Uh, I've seen somebody do it on shore at whatever, 9, 10, 11, whatever the, whatever the shortest distance you can do. He drug the uh, line, the, the bait, right up onto the shore where it was still technically in the water and still the pole was still technically cast, according to the computer. So the fish will actually jump right up on the land, turn sideways, and still be trying to bite your bait. And you can actually hook them and bring them right in, just like that, right on the right on the land already. So there's literally no effort to doing this if you do it the right way. But sometimes you'll you'll get one of those one of those cantankerous fish that'll he'll take you right back out there and he'll go 225, 250 out there, and sometimes they'll snap your line. Definitely have 300 plus feet of line on every one of your poles here because they will snap it in a heartbeat. They'll take it all the way out and just snap it because it's the end of your line. Uh, I, I throw my, it doesn't really matter where you put your stand at, you're going to fish to the same location and just rack them. Uh, I included two catches on this one because the first one happened so fast, kind of threw me off and I forgot to do the map, so I, I ended up waiting for a second catch and then did the map for the marker to be able to show you guys in the beginning. Uh, I reeled this one into 14, and then as you drop it, it kind of goes up a little bit. But here we go, whatever I, I didn't look at the screen when I threw that yeah, 15. Sure enough, it works. Uh, I know he almost snapped my line right there, but I brought him in so fast he didn't have a chance to snap it. He was already in. And here's your second one here just for a, a double feature, a two for one special here for both of, both of them happen to be on the cat boxer, but all three of these rods has caught, has caught dozens of these sturgeon. They all work just as well. You guys get out here and catch some fish, get some money. Later.